So we get to play father and daughter. I also like telling this book because I get to be a puppet. <laughs> in my, in one of our shows. I get to play Daddy Chicken in our version of David Ezra Stein's marvelous book called Interrupting Chicken. Interrupting Chicken. Interrupting Chicken. <laughs> Are you ready for bed, little chicken? Yes, Papa, but you forgot something. What did I forget? A bedtime story. Bedtime story. How could I forget? How could I forget a bedtime story? Now, if I tell you a bedtime story, will you promise not to interrupt the story? I promise I won't interrupt. And you're going to be good? I'll be good. And you're going to go straight to bed afterwards? Straight to bed. Okay, we will tell a bedtime story. Oh, here's a good one. Hansel and Gretel. Woo! Hansel and Gretel were very hungry. And deep in the woods, they found a house made out of candy. Woo! Nibble, nibble, nibble. They began to eat that house made out of candy until the old woman who lived there, she came out and she says, Oh, what's wrong with children? Why don't you come inside? Oh, no. They were just about to follow her inside that old house. Oh, no. I'll just go to my dream and she said, Don't go in, she's a witch. So Hansel and Gretel did the end. Little chicken. Yes, Papa? You interrupted the story. Try not to get so involved. Oh, I'm sorry, Papa, but she was a mean old witch. Yes, I just a story not to It's just a story. You're supposed to be getting tired. You're not even sleepy. Can we try another story, please? Are you going to interrupt the story? I won't interrupt. So you're going to be good? I'll be good. Are you going to go straight to bed? Straight to bed. Okay, we'll try another story. Oh, here's a good one. Little Red Riding Hood. This is a good one. <laughs> okay. Take this basket of goodies to Grandma, said the Little Red Hat's mother. But don't stray far from the path. The woods are full of danger. So, so Red Riding Hood skipped along through the deep woods. But by and by, she met a wolf. <gasps> and that wolf bit her good boy. Oh, no. She was almost ready to answer that big bad wolf. But all of a sudden. Oh, just a little bit She said, don't talk to strangers. So Little Red Riding Hood did the end. <laughs> little chicken. Yes, Papa. You did it again. You ran around two stories. You're not even getting sleepy. Well, I'm sorry. Just a story. Now get back up here, please. Can we try one more little story, please? Are you going to interrupt the story? I won't interrupt. It's going to be good? I'll be good. And you're going to straight to bed? Straight to bed. Straight to bed? Straight to bed. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we'll try one more story. Okay. Ah, uh, one of our favorites. <gasps> chicken Little. I'm a chicken. Nice it. Chicken Little was hit on the head by an acorn. Ew! Um, the sky is falling, she thought. She was about to run off and warn Goosey Goose and Ducky Lucky and Henny Penny and everybody on the farm that the sky was falling. But I'll talk to Little Red Chicken and she said, don't panic, it was just an acorn, so Chicken Little did the yet. Little Chicken! <laughs> yes, Papa? You did it again! You've been driving three stories, you're not even tired. Oh, but Papa, I couldn't let that Little Chicken get all upset over an acorn. Please read me one more story, I promise I'll oh. be good. Please, 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 please. Oh, that Little Chicken. We're all out of stories. What? We're all out of stories. You got our three stories. And... <laughs> 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 I can't talk about a bedtime story. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I've got an idea. Why don't you tell me a bedtime story? Uh, tell you a story? Sure, why not? Well, I can try. Well, why don't you do that? Bedtime for Papa. Five chickens. Sounds pretty good. Once there was a little red chicken who put her Papa to bed. Turned the hundred stories. She even gave him more milk, but nothing worked. He stayed wide awake all night. Papa? <laughs> Thanks for coming out on this uh, cold rain, maybe worse weather.